This video will forever change the way you see the narcissist. Narcissists are grandiose. They are always trying to impress people. They are always trying to show you why they think they are better than you. As though you are not good enough for them. But if you observe all of the things they're doing to you, you should realize that they are actually jealous of you. Even though you may not think of them like that, you're not trying to compete with them in anything. You're not comparing yourself to them. But they're trying to compete with you. They're constantly comparing themselves to you because they're very insecure. Their jealousy is like love and hate at the same time, but they don't really love you. If they did, they wouldn't be jealous of you. They're jealous of you because they have very low self-esteem and they're very insecure. Which is why they're always watching what you're doing. They're always comparing themselves to you. And they're always talking about their accomplishments. They're always boasting about what they've got. They might be able to have a normal conversation with someone else, but they can't do that with you. Because they see you as being better than them. You're the greatest person they know. You're the most attractive and impressive person they know. You're the most intelligent person they know. You are the person they can turn to when they need knowledge, advice, or reliable performance. You are the person who is doing the best things in life. That's how they really see you. They know you're the best. But they will never tell you that you're the best. Because they don't want you to know. They want to keep you down. They want to make you insecure. Because that's how they control you. But they will constantly tell you about how great they are. Or about how great someone else is. They will never tell you how great you are because they're competing with you. They see you as their competition. They're not working with you as a team. They see you as their opposition. And although they may brag and boast, about all of these things they're supposed to be doing. You know they're really not doing anything great. You know they're not a strong influence. You know they're not really successful. And you know they're not better than you. But you don't try to prove yourself to them. Because you already know what you're doing. You already know your worth. You already know your value. So you don't need to tell them everything about your life. Because everyone already knows you're an amazing person. 
They already know you're doing big things. So there's no reason for you to tell anyone what you're doing because they already know. But the narcissist always has to brag and boast about their accomplishments. They always have to talk about their life because otherwise you're not going to know. If they didn't tell you about it, you would never know because they're not really making an impact. They're not really doing anything big. But if you try to talk to them, they will just ignore you. They will act like they didn't hear you as a way of trying to put you down. They're trying to put you beneath them because they already feel small in comparison to you. So they will ignore you. They will focus on something else. They will direct their attention to another person until it makes you doubt yourself. Until it makes you feel like something is wrong with you. They want you to see everything they're doing, but they don't want you to talk about it. They don't want you to dispute the truth or validity of it. They just want you to accept it as they display it to you without any doubt or uncertainty. They want you to think that they don't like you. but they're not going to tell you the real reason why they don't like you. They're going to make you think it's because you're not good enough when really it's because you're too good. It bruises their ego. It injures their pride. So they will act like they don't see anything you're doing. They will act like it isn't as great as you think it is and they will just focus on something else. Something that isn't even a fraction of what you're doing. But they will exaggerate it and make it seem like it is more than what it really is. They want to feel important because they know you're more special than they are. They know you're a better person. They know you're honest and authentic. They know you're more respectable than them. They know you're more worthy. You're more confident. You're more intelligent. They know they're just an ordinary person, but they want their five seconds of fame. They want their short time in the spotlight before they are quickly forgotten. Which is why they cannot acknowledge anything you're doing. Because they're so full of hate. They're envious of you. So when you try to talk to them, they will ignore you. Or they will change the topic of conversation. They will talk about something else. Because although they may act grandiose. Although they may act like they're superior to you. Deep down, they already know you're better than them. That's why they're always trying to elevate themselves. They're trying to demonstrate they're at a higher level. When their reality is very different, it's an illusion. And they want you to support it. They want you to share their fantasy, which has no basis in reality. So they will talk about something they've done, or they will talk about someone else's accomplishments. Instead of giving you the acknowledgement and praise that you deserve, 
because they already know you're better than them. They just can't stand it. They don't want to accept it. So instead, they will throw shade on you. They will criticize you. They will express contempt for you. They will act like you're beneath their consideration. They will ridicule you to try to make you feel like you are less than them, which is how you should know that they are jealous of you. You may have a passion or interest for something. You may have a business and they will talk about someone who is doing the same thing as you, but not you. Because they are jealous of you. So they will always direct the topic of conversation to something other than you. Even though you're supposed to be their friend. They're supposed to be in your corner. They're supposed to be on your side. But they will not support your passions or interests. They will not support your business. Because they haven't got any passions or interests of their own. They haven't got a business. Which consumes them. It causes them to obsess over you. To where they will start putting you down. They will tell you how to do things. They will say you're doing everything wrong. Because they don't want you to win. They don't want you to succeed. They just want your attention. So they will criticize everything you do. Even though you may have all of the answers, even though you're doing it right, they will still tell you it's wrong because they're jealous of you. But they targeted you because they were watching you from a distance. They could see how good you're doing. So they had to pay attention to you. They had to gain concentration and consciousness. They had to reach out to you. And then you helped them out. You upgraded their lives. And then suddenly they ghosted you. They didn't do what they said they were going to do. And it makes you wonder why they did that. But they had to reach out to you. Because you were so brilliant and excellent at something. You were happy with your life. And they wanted your attention. But now they want you to chase them. They want to make you feel like you need their help. But they're never going to give it to you. Because they don't have anything to give. It's all fake. They just created an illusion. But now they will pretend like they never needed you. Because they're jealous of you. And they're fighting to be better than you. They're competing with you. They're always comparing themselves to you. They're always watching you. But they don't want you to know that they're watching you. Because they don't want to give you credit. They don't want to acknowledge your success. They see you. But they act like they don't. They want you to do everything for them, but they don't want to acknowledge it. They don't want to give you credit. They don't want to tell you. You're the best person they've been with because they're afraid that then they won't get what they want from you. 
they are afraid that you will realize they're not good enough for you. So instead they end up hating on you when they're actually your biggest fan. They're more focused on you than anyone else. They're always watching you, but they cannot come out and admit it because they're so full of pride. They're conscious of their own dignity. They have an exaggerated sense of self-importance, so they don't connect with you. They don't associate themselves with you. They don't support you because they have a lack of love for themselves, which is why they're never happy for you. Thank you for watching. I hope this video resonates with you. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. If you would like to donate, my PayPal link is in the video description. Coaching inquiries, you can email me at coaching at narcsurvivor.co.uk. Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.